Hey guys, it's Tiffany from Growing Dawn. Welcome back to another vlog. You can probably hear the dishwasher in the background, sorry. I thought I would give you guys an update on what we're doing today. Just kind of take you along for a few things that I need to get done and show you Mula, um, how she's doing, how she's growing. Um, it's really exciting to see the changes happening in her body right now. So we just finished up school and I am in the process of making lunch right now. I'm hoping that this afternoon, once Levi lays down for a nap, I can get up to the garden because honestly, I think it's probably been about two weeks since I was even up there. I am sure it's looking crazy right now, um, but I need to go up there and check it out and harvest as much as I can and just get in my mind exactly what we need to do to completely put it to sleep for the winter. Um, we're going to be having our community come up, I think next week at some point to all do some work together on it. So I need to go check it out. Today is my sister's birthday, so we may be heading over to her property later. I don't know for sure. Steven's gonna be working outside on the shed. The kids are gonna be what did Dada say you guys are doing today? Scooping poop. <laughs> Your favorite job. No, it's not. Uh, so the boys are going to be scooping some poop out of the yard today. And I don't know what else we're doing today. I guess we'll just see. to strain my garlic oil that I made in the natural remedies video that I did a couple weeks ago. So I am so I have these amber bottles and I have these little whoop, these little tiny funnels and I'm going to strain it in here and we will have garlic oil ready to go. back from the garden I'll try to show you guys her udder and her baby belly okay so here goes just got out here to the garden and oh my goodness the okra is like 10 feet tall Also, totally forgot that I still had watermelons out here growing. Is it raining? Seriously, it was not supposed to rain today. <sighs> Just started sprinkling. Wow, there is still so much here. Let's see what we can harvest. You see that? Look how big it is. <sighs> it actually doesn't look as bad as I thought it would, honestly after two weeks of neglect. Um, whoops. Definitely left some of these peppers on here a little too long. Looks like the rabbits have gotten into most of the things I planted last month, which I expected. These are some collards growing. Look at all those tomatoes. Well, oh, hi, kitty. Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Hi, Cypress. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Let those go a little too long. So I'm gonna grab these watermelons for sure. Yep, my one white pumpkin is rotted. Get the 
plant is completely dead. I do have a little bit of cilantro growing over here. That's fun. Oh my goodness, look at this. So some of the plants that I started from seed um, were purple beauty peppers and when I planted these peppers I did a horrible job of keeping track of what I put where so a lot of these I didn't know exactly which plant they were and I haven't gotten any of these yet this year and these are really small but look I got purple peppers let these get way too big. On the plus side, I know that I'll have plenty of okra seed. shocked at how much food I'm still getting from this garden. I should have brought more than just one basket. I am going to cut as much of this Swiss chard that I can and then I think I will be done. watermelon helpers. The other two. not lazing around so I'm gonna go give her these Swiss chard scraps and show you guys her baby belly. Are you excited? Let's turn the fence off. Oh my goodness the flies are so bad. Look at that. Mm. You love it. Let's see if we can feel baby move. Let's see if I can 
actually get in here. Ooh. Okay. There have been a few times that I have actually seen the baby move. Okay, she's getting distracted by my camera strap. Let's fix this. There we go. There you go. Hey girl. Let me give you some loving. Let me give you some loving. Oh yeah. Girl. I think I feel a little movement in there. So, she's looking good. <laughs> okay, okay, chill out. So there's her udder. Her udder is definitely filling out nicely. We are two months out from her due date, almost exactly. I calculated her due date, I think, as December 13th. <sighs> so today has been one of those days where you feel like you've done a lot, but it doesn't look like you've done a lot. <laughs> uh, we are getting ready to head over to my sister's property for a little campfire and hot dog roast. But I thought I would show you guys what Steven got done today and how progress on the shed is going really quick. That is going to be the pen for the calf. So we probably won't separate the calf until after a month or so, but we wanted to go ahead and get it built because we're going to be building the stanchion right up against it. And we wanted it all to be ready and set. So it's looking good. Still kind of a mess out here, but we're getting there. So yeah, like I said, it's been a pretty productive day, but my yard and my house doesn't show it, but I did get some Swiss chard preserved from the garden, cut up some watermelon for the kids, made some chili for our cookout tonight, cleaned up the kitchen. That's about the only thing that's clean right now. It is all good. I'm going to end this vlog here. I will see you guys in the next video.